What, you know, you, yesterday you told me that um, at least for the first time you were in line to vote. Yeah. And uh, you told me that uh, you wanted to make sure that uh, the Islamic Brotherhood do not mm -hmm. dominate parliament. No, no. Uh, mm. Let me make that absolutely clear to the listeners and to you. Uh, when I speak of Islamists, there are three different Islamist parties. Mm -hmm. There's the Muslim Brotherhood, who are moderate Islamists. Then there is the Salafists, who are funded by Saudi Arabia, who are the militant Islamists. That's the second party. And then the third one is a uh, wishy-washy Islamist party, which is called Wasat, which in Arabic means moderate. So when we talk about the Islamists, we are not talking about a solid block. We are talking about three major trends. I see, I see. The biggest of them is the Muslim Brotherhood. But there is the Salafists, who are the most militant, the most hard line, and there is the Wasat, who are uh, a wishy-washy Muslim party. I know this is uh, perhaps a very unfair question. Who did you vote for, Gamal? I voted for Kotla, which is the uh, party of the um, secular... Uh, it's the secularist party. And I just learned about an hour ago that we've won uh, Luxor. Luxor is the ancient capital okay. of ancient Egypt. Thebes, as you know. I see. Luxor. So you, you pretty much and won so the, the heart and the soul. That's a great symbolic uh, uh, achievement for the secularists that the capital of ancient Egypt is the party that I voted for, which has won the Kotla. Uh, and that's a great, of great significance to me because not only does it represent the past, it represents the future of Egypt. Now, Gamaro, we do have uh, two panelists here, and one of them is Cynthia. Uh, she seems to be of the view that uh, these elections, really, are probably selections, not elections that are going to be free, fair, and transparent. What is your view in, in, in terms of what you have been able to see for yourself? So far, they have been free and fair. Mm -hmm. The party that is going to gain the majority is the Muslim Brotherhood Party, which is the freedom and justice. Incidentally, <laughs> they, uh, they adopted the uh, slogan of my father, father, uh, my father, Kwame Nkrumah's <laughs> freedom and justice uh, uh, slogan. So the Muslim Brotherhood are the ones that are going to win. Uh, I, I, Majority of votes. Are you getting... And that, I, I have no, uh, no doubts about it. The Muslim Brotherhood, uh, the Freedom and Justice Party, is the one that is going to win the most votes. Are you by any chance, uh, given that you are the son of Kwame Nkrumah, getting uh, any royalties uh, from... Uh no, no, I'm not voting for them. <laughs> <laughs> now, no. what about... Uh I, I'm, vo I'm voting for the secular, who I have explained before, have won Luxor, which is a symbolic a victory. It's the part, it's Luxor 
is the ancient capital of ancient Egypt. I hear you. I hear you. What about people who are concerned about the fact that uh, the ballot boxes are not sealed? They have no seals. They have keys. How, to what extent do you trust the people that have unfettered access to that key, that almighty key? Look, uh, uh, under Mubarak, uh, the ex-president Mubarak, um, of course, a majority of the poor people, the underprivileged, had no say. And so I do not... Um, I cannot really condemn them for voting for the Muslim Brotherhood. No, I don't think you got uh, the gist of the question. Freedom. The Muslim Brotherhood it goes under the name of Freedom and Justice Party here in Egypt. No, Gamaro, the question was about uh, the ballot boxes not being sealed, that they have keys. To what extent uh, can you be so confident as to the people, the men, men and women, that have access to that key? Uh, my brother, I'm glad you mentioned men and women, because women are not voting for the Islamists. They want, they, w the women of Egypt do, do not want to be stuck at home and be homemakers and um, not have political rights. So the women of Egypt are those who have the choice. Uh, the women of Egypt are not voting for the Islamist party.